Remember, the Internal Revenue Service once spent $25,000 on a happiness expert. And what does he say makes you happy? One of the experiments I did was one called helping the elderly. Problem is, the IRS has struggled to help taxpayers of all ages. So the IRS commissioner is pressing Congress for more money next year. Is your mic, is your mic on? Microphone. Mic. Check mic, mic check. You mean you'd actually like to hear this? Yes, there you go. <laughs> we want accountability. Well, Congress slashed funding at the IRS after the agency harassed mainly conservative activists and fueled the rise of the Tea Party. To those who say the tea bags look silly, you would say what? They look silly. The IRS also looked silly when it played Star Trek on Company Time. Are you guys ready? Come on in. And Blue Muddy Line Dancing spent $17,000 just to watch a guy paint. Well, they watched a guy paint a picture of Bono. Do what? The IRS also raided its own hiring fund on travel and entertainment and spent nearly $50 million on conferences since 2010 and did not track attendance or document some expenses or get receipts. In my private experience, you would have been fired on the spot. <clears throat> Excuse me. And when Congress pressed the agency for emails for its investigation, the emails disappeared. I did not say I would provide you emails that disappeared. If you have a magical way for me to do that, I'd be happy to know about it. Congress was so mad it punished the IRS by cutting its funding. But when Congress targeted the IRS, we all took some collateral damage because the IRS is trying to serve customers and police fraud with a smaller staff. It frustrates law-abiding taxpayers and gives cheats a better chance of ripping us off. The most recent IRS study of the tax gap released in 2012 found that the tax gap was $385 billion the IRS did get a $290 million infusion in December, and that did help bring down wait times somewhat this year. But given its recent history of controversy and waste, congressional leaders are hard pressed to give the IRS all the money that it says it needs. Because polling has shown a majority of Americans say they are overtaxed, and faith in government is near an all time low. It goes back to the IRS protest that took off three years ago. So, this IRS that you speak of, they're. they're collectors of taxes and it goes back to the concerns first expressed by our founding fathers once again patrick henry take it away the government is not following the constitution our supplications have been disregarded shall we gather strength by irresolution and in action give me a break until the glorious object of our contest shall be obtained armed in the holy cause of liberty there is no retreat we must Fight. But to those who say you don't have enough passion, you would say what? Bull.